is up guys? Alagad ng sining again and this is me Mike, an artist from Naga City and it's been a year since I started creating posters and creating tutorials for art competitions and it started feeling like I need to get serious with all these things that I'm doing. So, the start of my second year of creating art What's up guys? This is Mike! At ngayong araw, eto gagawin natin. I want to build up on my art arsenal. My, my creative weaponry. My creative thing. Whatever that is called. So let's see what's inside all those boxes and very excited to unbox all these things. So let's open it. All right, let's start off with the smaller ones like this one. You know, these brushes of different size, very beneficial to creating details on your paintings. Okay, what about this? Okay. These are 4B, 8B, 7B Mars Lumograph Black. This will be used for portraits. Okay. It's the Mono Zero Eraser. I ordered this early July, but it arrived late. So I could have used this on the recent portrait that I did, but it was late. I still can use this on other portraits that, are, that I plan to create. So let's just leave it here. Okay, what about this one? These are the Mont Marte Gallery Series brush set. Let's see what's inside. It's so fine. But this one. So this is the Prang watercolor. It's the eight color set and it has a free brush. A very fine one. Alright, let's move on to the next one. Guess what it is? This is what I've been waiting for. The Prisma Color Premiere. It's the 48 color set. I'll be mostly using this for portraits and detailing on my oil pastel works. Let's go open it up. Let's see what's inside. Yeah! Okay. Part one, part two. Oh, there you go, you got two sets. I think each set is 24. It's the first time that I'm having these kind of pencils. I plan on working on a lot of fun arts using these. So expect a lot of anime stuff from me from now on. That's it. Uh, that's the Prisma Color 48 set. Love it. Let's move on to the next one. All right. So you got three sets. Each set has 36 um, colors. Let's check the other one. Right. This will be mostly used for what else? Poster making contests or uh, poster videos that I'm creating. So there you go. And then let's see what these are. 
Okay, I think these are the poster colors from HBW. Let's open it up. Let's take. So what I love about it is that it has its own um, case. Like all the colors are inside the case. And you have the freedom to create a lot of different colors because it has more than just five. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, twelve. So you got twelve colors out of these and it has brown. So we got two sets. So what about this big one? Okay. Still don't know what's inside. Alright. Okay. So these are the electric sharpeners. So it's battery operated. It looks really cool. Very futuristic design, and I like the colors. So we got five of these. So let's move on to the next. Let's see what's inside this thing. I think these are the action cams that I ordered. Okay, it is. Uh, it's a SJ4000A action camera. These have some accessories inside. So this one is a decent action cam that you can use for time-lapsing your artwork so you can have a better footage of whatever art you're working on. So I think these things are necessary. What about these things? Got the receipt. I think these are the paints, the acrylic paints that I ordered. Okay, got the white, the cadmium yellow. So this is the burnt sienna, ultramarine blue. And I think this is the cadmium red. Yes, it is the cadmium red. So these three are the primary colors: red, yellow, and blue. Then I ordered the burnt sienna. It's better if you have it ready than thinking of mixing it from your palette. I also have ordered another set where you can find the black and the secondary colors and I think it's here. <laughs> These are cute. Okay. <laughs> well, I'm not expecting that these are really this small. I love the colors, but I wasn't expecting that it's really this. I've been looking for this color. It's the Quinacridone. Quinacridone magenta. Then we got some cadmium orange. So this is the black one. Violet and green. And these are my secondary colors. And so we got some magenta and black. Yeah. Well, I'm a bit disappointed because it's really small, but you know, I was so attracted buying this because it's too cheap, but it really shows up to its price. So it's nothing we can do. That's just how it is. So these are all the acrylic paints that I ordered because I want to get serious on painting on canvas once again. I want to get back to where I started and let's move on to the next one then. So this one is, I think, the one that I got from Stedler because I got the second prize and it arrived yesterday. 
So I wasn't expecting any package that's gonna come. And it arrived yesterday, so let's go ahead and open it up. You gotta be careful. Well, I'm a bit impressed, because these are more than what I was expecting from them. I've <laughs> been looking for these blending stumps. This will be used for portraits where you can blend your values and tones. So we got Stedler pencils. There. These are like the normal Mongol type pencils, but it's from Stedler. Then they got me some sharpeners with, uh, with a lot of different kind of pencils, but it's got some 8B, 2B, and HB. I never knew they have this kind of jumbo type. So this one is 4B, and they also got the 8B. These guys are big compared to the normal ones. I also have a brush. Huh. This is different. So it's, I don't know if this is a pencil or an eraser. Let's try it out. I don't know what this is. It's kind of new to me. It's like a blue, blue brush at the end. And I don't know if this is something that you use for blending or coloring, but it's got some white tip. So I gotta do my research about this. Then we got the colored pencils called 24 Luna. It's safe for children, so I, I believe these are for kids. Well, this is, it's decent. Because it's good. That's fine. And we also got another. This is the Stedler Luna watercolor pencils. It's got 24 set of pencils. And let's see what's inside. Ah, this is this is amazing. It's got a free brush. But I think these things are decent. So we gotta, we gotta do a, a review. So we gotta try this thing before we judge it. So but I believe these things are good. At least you can, you can have that kind of watercolor feel with your color pencils when you apply water to it. So I'm very excited to get to try these things. Right, so these are the things that I got from Stedler because I won the second place award from the recent contest they did about um, COVID-19. And I, I want to thank them for appreciating and awarding my work. So I think the only thing that we need to unbox is the biggest one. Okay, I think we still have one here. But, uh, okay. This is the acrylic mixing palette. It looks really cool when you are holding it while doing your painting. This is inspired by Bob Ross. I love looking at him having his kind of transparent um, palette while he does his videos, so decided to use this. So I got a ton load of Stedler pencils right now. Okay, so I think I got a mechanical pencil as well. Okay. Gotta take some out from my table and see what's inside one of those boxes. This is the anti-theft bag that I ordered. Let's see what's inside. The cushion is so good. So 
also it's got like a USB port. It's where I think you can charge your phone while your power bank is inside your bag. And let's see what's inside. Okay, so there really is a USB cord. And then this is these are the laptop compartments. It's got some bubble thing. You can store your pencils here. Some nice zippers. And a few more compartments inside. The material is decent and a lot of artists can benefit from having one of these. So the color is very simplistic. It's very uh, minimalistic design, and it's a bit big than uh, than I was expecting. I think the build is good, and the colors are really standing out. Very simplistic design, and that's what I love about it. So I got two more bags, but I'm not gonna open any, all of them, cause I think there's, they're just the same. Well, I just got a news right now that my bro will be sending us new shoes from Thailand, and that's that really is a good news. So these are the actual shoes that he's going to be sending. There are four pairs and all will be sent here to our family members. This, this white one is the one that's for me. So shout out to you, bro. Thanks for sending all of these. We love it. By the way, I also bought two things from National Bookstore yesterday. And these are papers. So this is a sticker paper that I might use on packaging. Then my favorite one, Crayola Crayons. And we got these two. It's a heat transfer paper, which you can use for t-shirt designs. And I plan on designing one of my shirts something that I can use for my videos, but I don't have a white shirt for now. I'll be trying to look for one. I love signing my own shirt. I never used this kind of method before because we used to create silk screens. We do the silk screen processing with all that. I still love the old method, but I love trying new things and experimenting. I'm gonna take a video of how it turns out. This costs like, uh, 225 and you got three sheets on it you can use this on a black shirt also bought these things from national bookstore this one's the Vecco um, vellum boards as well and the last but not the least this one is the Canson drawing paper the size is A4, 90 GSM, costs 98 pesos, 98 pesos only from National Bookstore. I also got myself a few illustration boards and crystal boards out there, but I'm not gonna be opening anymore because it's already open. Um, you know LBC Warehouse. Um, Pinuntahan ko na dito kasi hindi na deliver sa amin yung mga packages. And yung mga packages na yun ay mga art materials. So sana makuha natin. By the way, having all these kind of materials is fun. It's overwhelming. But skill, the art skill, does not come in them. So it doesn't work that way. You cannot buy skill from Shopee, Lazada, or even National Bookstore. Art skill comes with time, comes with patience, comes from discipline, it comes from willingness to learn, it comes from 
getting out there and doing your art. You can actually create art even without all these things. Whatever you got right now is something that you can use to improve your skill. Be it crayons, be it coffee, be it, there's a lot of things that you can use, whatever is available at the moment in your house, just do it because all these are things only and we are not collectors we are creatives we don't collect we create and lastly I want to live my creative truth that's just creating art that resonates my true art what it is about me that makes me me we don't just draw anime to impress our friends we create art because there is a piece of us in those drawings that we do. So I'd like to focus more on oil pastels, artworks, and I wanna get back to acrylic painting because that's where I started and that's where I feel me. That's my creative truth. So that's it for this video. I hope you learned something out of these and um, on the next video, we will be unboxing a bigger item let's open this beast so just watch out see you in the next video Done.